Shanti, how do you de deal with uh, fear of death or fear, fear of illness? Yes. All the living creatures have four things in common. Ahar, Nidra, Bhaya and Maithun. Ahar means food. Nidra means sleep. Bhaya means self-preservation. And procreation means continuing generation. Animals, all animals have it, but humans have extra faculty which is intellect. And because of intellect they get in trouble. Animals, they don't worry about it. You know, just, just they have fear for survival only. We have fear, artificial fear. One thing we do is we think of the future too much. Animals, only they think for survival, so they don't have to think too far. All the fears are magnified when you extend yourself in the future because mind can imagine, mind can think of all the negative things. Mind can think about something happened to someone that would happen to me. Anything happened in the past, all the memories come on the surface. So we suffer more. So one thing is to be in the present. Any meditation that keeps you in the present is ideal. Other thing is impermanence. If we understand that everything is impermanent, we cannot hold on to anything. If we do that, then we cannot hold on to anything, any person. We cannot hold on to our body. It would be changing. It will be getting older. It will get sick and it will die. If one accepts that more and more, which is difficult, but more you accept, then it becomes easier. On the other hand, people who resist that, I'm old, so they try to do extra makeup or extra shows or they feel death is coming by, so they seek more company because they feel lonely. So go to parties, collect things, but all this hiding under the sand. Another fundamental thing is duality, because more we create a du duality, I am separate from you, greater is fear. If I am alone, there is nobody else. That means I, I, I. Who would I be afraid of? If I am the only thing that exists, where would I go? What is death? All this becomes easier to accept. So this is the duality, you know, we try to avoid. Also body's attachment. We are so much attached to body. This is the greatest fear. Attached to body because we are born with the body, we deal with the body, hunger, thirst, pleasure, pain, everything is in the body. All the sense organs exist in the body, all the motor organs exist in the body. But in reality, we are consciousness. Consciousness functions through the body. Consciousness is separate from the body. Consciousness uses the body for using sense organs to receive, motor organs to react. So consciousness is separate. When we are in deep sleep, consciousness is separated. So we don't see, we don't hear, we don't feel anything. We don't even dream. In dream, we repeat the memory. So consciousness could be separated. All the problems and maya is identifying consciousness with the body and that is very very common for everyone to whatever extent we separate ourselves from the body to that extent we have freedom so how do we separate ourselves so we become observer like observer that uh, drishta that I am consciousness watching my body. If you are in the body, you become one with it, you suffer a lot. But you separate yourself, you don't suffer as much. Just like you see somebody suffering, 
you don't feel their suffering, you just imagine their suffering, but it's not yours. So to that extent, if we can separate ourselves from the body, body goes through whatever suffering, we won't feel it. And this is feasible, this is possible, doable. So many great masters have done it. Like they had very bad problem, health problem. They remain blissful, doctors can tell that one would be in agony. They separated their consciousness from the body. Wow. Other thing is we can do, we become a witness. See, drishta is observer, like separating, but this still there is a duality. But become a witness. Witness is everything happening within me. Like space is a witness to everything happens within it. Space is not touched by it. So the meditation would be to be witness to everything that is happening. Hmm. And this could be done in the form of meditation. We can do separately. Okay. Okay. okay.